Hello YouTube, Mr. Twister here, testing out a new recording device, a GoPro, believe it or not. Um, got this nifty little smart smart remote. Anyways, that's enough about the new tech. Um, today I'm going to be showing you, again, how to make a great pumpkin. I tried making one a little while ago, or tried making a video for this a little while ago, and my phone just crapped out on me completely. So, ta-da! Yay! Hopefully the audio is actually getting picked up as pretty good as well. So, today we're going to be using black 260Qs and orange 260Qs and some green 260Qs for the hands. So, start off with the body. Triple pitch twist. This is for where this is where the head's going to be resting. Right, and go down, make a double pinch twist. This is going to be the hips. Being that the great pumpkin is like this humongously tall creature, kind of well, like a lot of other nightmare fuel creatures, I'm going to leave long leg, put a double pinch twist down here for the ankle. Make sure to lock it in good. Get rid of the excess. There's torso, or actually the truncated torso, and a limb on our leg. Put a little kink in there for the knee. I'll put that right there for real quick. Blow this one up. Now this one, we're just gonna make a double pinch, double pinch twist. Making it as long as the first leg, running into the hip. Get rid of that. Put another kink for the other leg, or for the other knee, and there we have two legs and a torso. Or divining rod. <laughs> All right, now we're doing the head. Grab your orange 260Q. Tie it off. Now lock it into this part right here to where it's sticking out the center. Like so. Now, go up a little bit. Make a double pinch twist. Like so. And now you're just going to go down, lock it in, up, lock it in, down, lock it in, up, lock it in. Until you start to see a pumpkin. cut this off, bite it off, or just hide it inside, or it won't come undone. And there we have the head. Now we take a dark green 260Q. Now 
Now, this is going to be pretty tricky. I'm going to inflate this all the way and let the air all out. Now, we wrap it around the fingers. And now, inflate it until you have a curly cue. Now, if you have to work with a, an air pump, the best way that you could do that is take like a Sharpie or something and wrap the balloon around that holding on to the tip, this part, so that it doesn't unwind when you're inflating it with your balloon or with your balloon pump. Um, it's just one of the many things that became so much easier for me when I became capable of blowing up a balloon with my mouth. So, resituate myself. Now we're going to put pinch twist. Make sure you tuck this in like so. And a four finger bubble. Hold it and then tie it in like this so that we have a hand. Twist it right there. this into the triple pinch twist like so and here we have a crazy vine arm now this side just put in a pinch twist about folding this over to make another hand because that could be just like a leaf or something. But there we have the body of the Great Pumpkin. Now for the face, I'm going to want to get a, a black marker like so. And just draw like whatever scary face you want to put on there. I normally try to go the classic like flame eyes and the, the jagged teeth. Other people might want to go for like, I don't know, a classic jack-o'-lantern. So yeah, if you guys have been enjoying this, leave a like, subscribe. If you have something on my, or in your mind that you would like to see me make, leave a comment down below. And for any that are actually listening or paying attention or anything, um, do you think it would be a good idea for me to do a blindfold challenge? Um, I know I'm not like as well known as a lot of other balloon twisters or other YouTubers in general, but I'm hoping this would actually be something that would be pretty cool. So let's get these teeth in.
Sorry, I got a little quiet there. Kind of going to myself whenever I'm like trying to focus on drawing stuff. Oh, speaking of drawing stuff, check out my other drawing. Check out some of my drawing videos too. Um, I promise one day to actually be able to finish drawing a dragon, but the dragons that or the dragon videos that I have, um, the pictures keep on getting lost. So, um, yeah, here's hoping. Um, and also, here's the great pumpkin. Here's the scary face. Rah. So, um, yeah. Again, leave a like, subscribe, comments down below. Um, later.